I found my dream apartment. In this video, I'll be going apartment hunting in LA, manifesting my dream apartment, and officially moving in. And stay tuned for the empty apartment tour. I'm officially moving out again. This all happened so quickly. This was a bit impulsive, a bit last minute, but it just happened. And I need to explain to you what's going on. So as I mentioned in my last video, I've been living in Calabasas for the last year and a half. And basically the lease for that apartment was going to end in February. So in December, just one random day, I decided to go drive out and go apartment hunting, not expecting to find anything. In my head, I was hoping that my next apartment would look something like this, which is just like like the dream apartment that you see on Pinterest, but I was pretty open to anything. I did have a few non-negotiables that I thought I would share with you guys. One of them, of course, being good and natural lighting. This is the top priority because I'm a content creator. I wanted a space with a minimum of over a thousand per feet just because I was looking to upgrade my space. I was hoping that my next apartment would have recreational amenities, like having a gym in the building would be so cool. I wanted the apartment to have an in-unit washer plus dryer. This time I wanted to move into a place that was walking distance to grocery stores, cafes, etc. Big windows with a pretty view were a must. And lastly, of course, a safe neighborhood because I'm gonna be living alone. There must be some sort of security as well. So the first day that I went apartment hunting, I was just looking at random apartments. Like the first one I looked at was this apartment that was kind of more up in the mountains, which had a really cool view. It was such a vibe. It was super cozy and I loved the windows in here. The only thing with this place was that it was in a very noisy area. Then the next apartment that we went to go see was a complete catfish. It looked nothing like the pictures online. I think the main selling point of this apartment was the fact that you could see the Hollywood sign right outside the window, which I thought was cool. But other than that, this place was pretty basic looking. It had nothing interesting about it, so... Moving on to the next. This apartment was super cute. The color of the wooden floors and the cabinets were perfect. The lighting was a 10 out of 10. The biggest no for me was the size of the room. It was just too small. Literally my bed would take up like half of the space. This was like the only apartment that I saw with a walk-in closet, which was cool. I then went to go view this other apartment in downtown LA and it was beautiful. The views were amazing. The windows were huge. It checked off a lot of my non-negotiables. I think the thing I loved about this place the most was the fact that it felt super safe for the price I think it was pretty worth it I almost got this apartment until I asked the lady to show me her two bedroom that she had available Because I was like if the one bedroom looks like this the two bedroom must be dreamy So when she showed me it I instantly fell in love <laughs> Last week, I applied for an apartment and I have been nervous. I have been non-stop bugging the lady that showed me the apartment and constantly emailing her to ensure that the apartment is mine. I have been manifesting it and today she's supposed to email me and I've been aggressively refreshing my emails to see what her response is and we're gonna check it. I'm nervous. I literally have not been able to sleep for the last days. I literally kept waking up at 4 in the morning feeling so much nervousness and excitement flowing through my body. And we're gonna check the email together. So let's take a look. You guys, if I don't get this apartment, you will never see a video from me ever again. Why is it not loading? <gasps> Hi, Adela. Congratulations. Your application is set up. Set up wrap. <laughs> Anywho, this is crazy. Confirm that everything looks good so I can generate your lease agreement. So that was how I found my apartment. So lucky, I barely had to do any apartment hunting. When I had stepped in, I just knew it was mine. I immediately put an application and this was the day that I went to go pick up my keys. <laughs> I'm currently sitting out on my balcony. I look like a mess, but I'm now at the new apartment. It's such a vibe out here. The weather is like super gloomy, but I'm gonna be giving you guys an empty apartment tour. I'm also waiting for my grandma to get here because I'm gonna be showing her my new place. And I already know it's gonna be emotional. She's probably gonna cry. 
I wanted to take a moment and just tell you guys how grateful I am for the millionth time. Getting to live here is such a dream. It doesn't feel real. There was a point in my life where I didn't even know what it was like to have my own room. Becoming a YouTuber was always a dream of mine. It wasn't something that I ever did, thinking that it would become my job. Like editing videos and creating content was always a genuine passion of mine. I shared a room with my sister my whole life in my grandma's house. We grew up in a trailer park in like a really sketchy neighborhood. And now here we are, thanks to you guys. Welcome to the humble abode. This is the official empty apartment tour. We first come in, this is the little entryway over here to the right. We have an in-unit laundry. I am so excited for the organization video. Moving on, so when you walk over here, this is a two-bedroom apartment. And this is the main room. It is so dreamy. Over here we have the main closet. Finally, a functioning, big, spacious closet. I'm gonna have my own bathroom. I finally have a bathtub. I'm so excited for the self-care night. I'm gonna get a cute little bathtub tray and the little hallway entering the room. There's also these little shelves. So let's come over here. You guys can literally see everything. Over here we have a balcony. Okay, then over here we have the kitchen. The one thing I'm most excited about is my sink. I finally have a normal size sink where I can actually wash my dishes properly. I also finally have an oven. This is like such a Pinteresty kitchen. I can't wait to organize it. You guys are not ready for the kitchen decorating videos. Check out my fridge. Look at the freezer. Anyways, now let me show you guys the rooms. So back over here, this is going to be a guest bedroom because like I said, this apartment is two bedrooms, two baths. I am still debating what I'm gonna be doing with this. Maybe it could be an office space. Over here, I have a closet. It's going to be like the main bathroom. But yeah, that is basically it. Okay, so today is the official move-in day. As you guys saw in my last video, I was having some movers help me bring everything to my new apartment. So far, we got a couple boxes in, my table, and I was honestly terrified because I have no idea how I managed to accumulate so many things in my last apartment. Like, I was living in such a tiny apartment, yet I feel like the moving out process was taking me longer than usual because I had so many things to pack somehow. And just seeing the amount of boxes that they filled up with stuff was shocking. Like, how? But yeah, Today's also the day that I'm going to be showing my cat my new apartment. I already know, he's gonna be scared. It'll probably take him about a day to adjust. boxes everywhere. I don't even know how I'm gonna get through all of these. So while my apartment is still sort of empty, I thought I would have a couple more friends and family come over to see my apartment and, and I'll try to show their reactions. I also did want to show you guys a little bit more of the apartment building itself. It comes with a lot of cool things and I'm so excited to live here. They have a yoga room, a gym, a rooftop, a pool, a whole like lounge area. They have a whole gym here, so now in the mornings, I could just come downstairs and get my workout in. This is literally going to be me in the summer. I am now up on the rooftop and this is like another little lounge area that they have. I could just come up here. I could just like bring my laptop out here and do some editing. I am literally entering my city girl era. Okay, so today's gonna be my first official night in my apartment. I'm gonna be having a couple of deliveries this week, like my new couch and my mattress. It will all be included in the upcoming moving vlogs. I will also be vlogging my first night here. Right now, I'm gonna be taking pictures in my new apartment because I realized I didn't do that. 
I don't know if I like this outfit. Let's try this one. 